Hi you guys, welcome back for another vlog. It is currently Wednesday and I think I'm gonna vlog today and tomorrow. Maybe Friday, but definitely today and tomorrow. If you're new to my channel, my name is Ruby. I'm 23. I live in New York City. This is my lifestyle channel. Lots of vlogs, couple sit down videos here and there. Currently, I feel like I'm very much so in my vlog era. Be sure to subscribe if you have not already. I post new videos two times a week. Also, be sure to go follow me on TikTok. We're trying to hit 25,000 followers over there. One of the reasons I'm vlogging today is almost to like kind of hold myself accountable because it needs to be a very productive day but I'm not feeling 100%. I'm not sick, like nothing like that, but I start my period tomorrow and so I'm just feeling a little like eh today, but I still have like so much to do. Tomorrow is my less busy day, so if I can just like power through today, I'll be fine. Um, in about an hour, I have to leave for a solid core coach training session. This one is only three hours today, thank goodness. So it's not gonna take up like my entire day. I'll be able to come back and take care of Dakota and finish up everything else that's on my to-do list. This morning I had a front desk shift at Solid Core, so lots of Solid Core stuff happening today. And then I actually stopped by H&M just because I was walking by and I feel like I never go into H&M, but I found two really cute things. So I thought we could do like a little quick mini, very mini haul. Okay, so let's get into the very mini H&M haul. By the way, my Halloween Town sweater is from Etsy. I got it last year, still obsessed with it. I honestly like haven't really done any fall shopping this year and that's just because I truly feel like I kind of have everything that I need in my closet. I just haven't really felt the need to shop, haven't felt inspired. Also with like hopefully planning a wedding starting within the next year, I've just been saving a lot. But I saw these two pieces and I thought they were really cute. So first I got this really cute, like super chunky cropped cardigan. I have it unbuttoned here cause I tried it on. Um, but I would probably just mostly wear this buttoned with like a little bralette underneath. I love how like chunky it is and like fit, it's kind of like, not cable knitted, but it's definitely like very textured. I love the chunky cardigan because you can definitely dress it like up or down versus this is definitely like very casual. It's this like camel tan color. And then it is just this super cozy, fuzzy pullover. And it does have like snaps right here. So you can make it kind of more turtleneck or not. I'm actually probably gonna wear this today walking to solid core training because it's not that cold out to the point that I would need a coat, but I don't just like wanna be in a t-shirt or something. This also came in a white and like a dark brown too, but I just thought this color was super cute with a pair of like black leggings, white sneakers, also having a white dog. If she sheds on me, which she does all the time, it's not gonna show up on this. By the way, this little pullover was only $17.99. I got it in a size small, just that it would be like a little bit bigger. And then the cardigan was $34.99, a little bit more expensive, and I got it in an extra small. That completes my very mini H&M haul. So, I am now going to pack up for solid core training. I still have like 30 minutes, but I wanna make sure that I remember everything because I do have to kind of bring a lot when I'm at my like training sessions. Um, and then I'm also gonna change my clothing and then we'll get ready to leave. It is unseasonably warm for the end of October today. This is actually crazy. I live so close to my mom's apartment because I literally just ran over here because I have a zoom meeting like a one-on-one -on -one in 10 minutes and the loudest construction just started right above me in Kevin's apartment there would have been no way to do the meeting there so oh, crazy speaking of crazy my hair looks wild because it's currently still drying but I did do a pretty cute little face of makeup today I actually really like my makeup I feel like it just I don't know it looks very fresh so yes 
I'm currently at my mom's apartment. If you've followed me for a while, this place would be very familiar to you. And I'm about to have a one-on-one -on -one with a client. I have a stand store, um, I'll link it down below, where you can book social media like one-on-ones with me, also acting one-on-ones with me. Um, and so I have somebody who booked an hour session to talk about like social media strategy and building their brand out on a few different platforms. So that's in like 10 minutes, like I said. Um, and then I'm actually really excited because we're doing something fun for lunch. At least I think we are. Kevin's working from home, meaning that I think he'll be able to join me. Um, but for now, I'm just gonna get set up for this meeting. I cannot believe that I had to run over here. I literally grabbed my computer and sprinted craziness. Ah, the joys of living in New York City. Don't get me wrong, like I love it, but this construction life directly above me and Kevin's Apartment, not cute and not pleasant on the ears either. Okay, just getting my computer out. By the way, I don't think I ever talked about this. This new um, laptop case that I bought for my MacBook Pro, I got it off of Etsy. Um, it's like a faux leather, like woven case. I actually really love it. It can be really hard to find um, cases for the 16 inch MacBook Pro. Pro and it was a little bit of an investment, but honestly, it's like great quality and I just, I don't feel comfortable like not having a case on my computer. Um, so I'll link it down below for you guys. Um, obviously like not sponsored or anything. I just love it. Honestly, I did not vlog much today, so maybe we will continue this vlog into tomorrow. I don't know, but um, I am trying out quite a bit of new skincare tonight, so I'm just going to do like a little show and tell quickly, not really go into depth with anything because I don't know how I'll like it. I was sent this in PR a few days ago, which is actually perfect timing because I just ran out of my face wash yesterday. This is the Keys Soul Care Golden Cleanser. Um, so far, it seems very gentle. It is very, very heavily fragranced. Um, so if you are sensitive to that, I would automatically stay away. But so far, I like the way it feels. Also trying out a new toner because you guys know, I think they're discontinuing my favorite Sephora collection, like Vitamin Tonic, I think is what it's called. Um, but I'm trying out their like actual toner now. This is the clarifying toner, if it will focus. It says that it purifies and minimizes your pore appearance. Oh, and then also I needed some new pimple patches and my Target was sold out of the Hero Cosmetics ones, which are my favorite pimple patches, that and the Peace Out ones. Um, so I decided to try these from Starface. These are the Hydrostar plus salicylic acid pimple patches. I think I tried the original ones before and I wasn't like super, super impressed. So I'm thinking I'm probably gonna like these better because they sound like they're a little bit stronger. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna try these out tonight. Well, I, I know I'm gonna try these out tonight, but hopefully I like them. Okay, it's the next day. I'm clearly still in the braids that I slept in last night. So ignore the crazy hair. Um, but I wanted to make sure that I got a little bit more vlog footage in for this video. Just so that like, it's a decent length um, and not like crazy short. I realized that I actually forgot to show you guys what I picked up um, during my little walk around Soho. I went to the Little Words Project store, um, their second one that just recently opened. And I picked up two things, um, one for myself and one actually for my dad because he's coming up here for Thanksgiving and I wanted to just like get him a little welcome present. Um, my dad like typically does not watch my YouTube videos but if for some reason he's watching this one, please click out. <laughs> I love Little Words Project. They're one of my like favorite brands and I love what they stand for and just, I have so many of their bracelets, it's not even funny. I actually, so I made a custom one for myself. I actually knew that I, wanted to do this once I was like officially into my solid core training just as something to really remember this time by I mean you can get like custom bracelets for little words project with like any saying on it any color in terms of like the beads and stuff um, but I just did this gold beaded bracelet I think it's just like the gold plated ones and then it says solid core on it so gonna become one of my new little everyday bracelets. I actually really like it and again it just like is commemorating this time and this very exciting new journey that I'm taking. And then like I said I got something for my dad. Just a little welcome gift and so it's this one right here with these really cool like 
brown and black beads i'll take the tag off obviously and then in black lettering is his strength i just thought it was really cool and for some reason i thought he'd really like this i'm hoping he does <laughs> so yeah little words project definitely go check them out not sponsored but i will tag them down below um they have so many great like pre-made bracelets but then like i said if you want to do custom designs um whether it's for yourself or a gift for a loved one or like a group of people i just think they're fantastic okay i just took my hair out of the braids i guess they're kind of they're like a variation on like a typical braid so yeah what else would i call it um i've really been loving you guys know like kind of the no heat hair um pretty much like on the regular right now um if you guys want a little tutorial i actually filmed one for tiktok that i'm going to be posting in the next few days um it's very minimal amount of products minimal amount of time but i really like the way that it turns out obviously it looks a little different every single time but Every time I've been doing this recently, like even strangers have been complimenting my hair, which is super sweet. So I've really been enjoying it. And I feel like it's cute, it's carefree, it's a little messy, it has texture, volume, we love. I do think I'm gonna end this vlog here though, just because I have a lot of editing to do on both this vlog and then I filmed my Sephora VIB sale yesterday and it's going up tomorrow morning, or my VIB sale haul. Filmed it yesterday, it's going up tomorrow morning. So I wanna make sure that, that is ready to go. But thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me everywhere. And I love you all. And I'll see you guys again very, very soon in my next video. Bye.